next week we were playing cross grip, just like this. I had the cross grip, I was coming right, crunching over, grabbing the pants, kind of like getting them a little bump, you know, coming back for some sweet triangle, stuff like that, right? Well, here though, if I start to like do this, and he keeps bringing his damn arm back, see that right there? Boom, I'm gonna just capture it this way now, okay? Now, this could be done statically, this could just be my cross grip. I come right under here, get my kung fu hand, and I pull back and I comb my hair like I'm John Travolta in Greece. Just like that. Come up, hug his head, thumb in the collar, loop this around to make some room, okay? And then I start rolling it in. You can see, come here, you wanna, you wanna look in this hole. You gotta, gotta get that, what is that, what is that, this stuff that, that in the ocean? I'm talking about like where the fish live in. Oh yeah. Where Dory lives. Yeah. Yeah. See, we get all that stuff out of the way. I roll this guy inward, and when I roll it in, it gives me a meaner grip. If you just pinch it just like that, my fingers start to hurt. But and I don't want to flip it out because my my fingers are going this way. So I roll it in, and I get that nice little grip right to there. Okay. Everybody good so far? So now I got some position. What's gonna happen is I'm gonna start to push the shoulder. I'm gonna start to push the shoulder and the hip out a little bit. And I'm gonna come right here and I'm gonna hit him with a, not a karate chop in the neck, but a forearm chop. Once I hit that forearm chop, I'm resting right there on all the good stuff, the triple warmers, you know, you do all that kung fu stuff. Here, I get my I forearm, I claw grip. Once I get the claw grip, I'm gonna twist down. Forearm in, and I bring my elbow to his chest and squeeze. And what's really making this devastating, guys, is this grip right here, that roll-in. It's a reverse boss grip. It's a reverse right? boss grip. Carlos showed this to me. Oh. Turn that inward just like that, and it makes the grip better, okay? So here, so we'll start back over real quick. All the same stuff. Got my cross grip. I'm gonna, I gotta use my legs, everybody. So right now, he's got good posture. So my toes are gonna go to the ceiling, and I'm gonna pull from my hips. Feel my hips, uh -huh. okay? Open it up, comb my hair like John Travolta, boom. Pull, thumb in the back, start opening that up. Hipping out, rotating and feeding. Trying to push this shoulder away and hip out to the side so I can get over here. Forearm, not hand. Forearm, claw, grip, twist. Twist, crunch. Just like that for the X choke. Okay, let's make that happen. One, two, three. Harry's on his back in the bottom of side control. Right? No, no, get, get, put your head over here. So he's in prayer position, just like this. Boom. He side bumps me and underhooks. See here? He gets up to his knees. See here? He starts to tackle me. Front row. I go right into the entry. Especially if I'm, if I'm losing the position. So if I'm gonna lose the position, I'm gonna at least dominate the position I lose to. Okay, so I landed in that overhook, right? right. So this is just an easy, very simple entry. So from here, he comes up, he's blocking, he's doing everything right, so stay right there. So I got my wizard. So I'm wizarding right to here, right? And he starts to tap my knee, I'm blocking his bicep, I immediately get to the guard. And I'm already feeding the lapel in and two i'm just kind of boom we're in position so now i'm in position instead of going for the x choke or i might be trying to make the x choke and i just can't make it work so now what's going to happen he's defending my hand okay so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to take my foot i'm going to hump back just a little bit and as i hump back i'm going to put my foot right here on his in his armpit and then i'm going to push his face and push his armpit and he's got a straight arm lock. Yep. It's very deceiving. And this is, it's not just an arm lock, that's an arm breaker. I thought you were going for the sweep, and I thought you said, I was like, no, that's, that's an arm breaker. <laughs> so, one more time from the entry. I'm here just like this, he starts to come up. Oh shit, he's taking me. So here, I'm gonna pull the guard. I already got that overhook. I'm stuffing the shoulder, and I'm just feeding off that lapel. Lift your chin up for me. See here, I'm feeding off that lapel. I'm rolling it inward getting it nice and tight. And I'm trying to I'm trying to go for this. I'm trying to get my knee in too, because it push your elbow out. If I can get my knee in, I want that, because that's gonna take me to the triangle. But he's keeping that elbow tucked, because he's 
He knows what's going on. So I'm trying to make this work. I can't get the choke. So what I'm gonna do is hold him, move me, okay? I just move me back, see how his arm straightens? Foot to the armpit, just cup, and I'm bringing my knee down and pinching as I push. Right to there, it's that easy, okay? It's a very, very sweet move. All right, so this is straight arm lock. One, two, three. 